Bob Beckel is the only liberal, and I use that term very loosely, on uh, Fox's show, The Five. Every once in a while, he says something that's somewhat sane, and everybody else flips out. So Eric Bowling and Bob Beckel decided to talk about affirmative action and economic mobility, and listen to their interesting back and forth here. Yes. Eric, do you believe that a uh, baby born to a crack mother in Harlem last night has an equal chance of life as a white a baby born to a white always couple in West Street? And, and I'm always that you've asked me this in the past, and I've said it in the past. Yes, you have the equal opportunity to succeed. That's what America is, providing everyone with an equal opportunity. That's what... Really? Really, Eric? You can't seriously believe that. Nobody can seriously believe that. That a kid who's born to parents that make $12,000 a year living in the middle of Harlem, constantly moving, growing up in massively underfunded schools in poor neighborhoods, they have just as good a chance as the son of Mitt Romney? That... Uh, look, I, I'm usually... I try to be fair to the right-wingers to say... Look, if we don't know whether or not they're lying or they just don't understand, always give them the benefit of the doubt and say they just don't understand, they don't get it, right? They're just lacking in the mental department. They're not actually deceiving you. No, in this case, I think bowling is just deceiving you. He's lying. He doesn't actually think that because he can't be that stupid. Nobody could be that stupid, but he's saying it anyway. And the interesting thing is, you heard him say too, look, the United States of America is built on equality of opportunity. Great, so join, uh, join the liberals, join the progressives. Help, help with us. You know, we're fighting for uh, universal health care, universal college, uh, to make it so that the middle class is actually the middle class again and they're not slipping into poverty. If you're in favor of equal, of, uh, equal opportunity, come join us. That's what we're fighting for. But he thinks that, uh, oh, they already have it. Really? The middle class and the poor in this country? have it just as good as the rich? Eric, that's just not true. Here, a quote, children born to poor parents have far less access to health care, nutrition, and education than their wealthy counterparts, regardless of race. Economic mobility in the United States is lower than in comparable nations, and 65% of those born in the bottom fifth of incomes stay in the bottom two fifths. Similarly, a study by the Brookings Institute found that, quote, only 6% of children born to parents with family income at the very bottom move to the very top.